Want to lose that stubborn belly fat in just a month? Well, you've come to the right place. We all know that belly fat can be a real bugbear. It not only impacts how we feel about ourselves, but also has serious implications for our health. It's been linked to many health issues, including heart disease, diabetes, and even certain types of cancer. But don't worry, it's not all doom and gloom. The good news is, with the right approach, it is possible to shed that stubborn fat and improve your health. That's exactly what we're here to do today. This video is your comprehensive guide to losing belly fat in a month. We'll provide a step-by-step -step plan that includes diet, exercise, sleep, and stress management. Because, let's face it, there's no magic pill when it comes to weight loss. It takes a holistic approach. So, stick around to discover the steps to achieving your weight loss goals. Before we jump into the solution, it's important to understand the problem. So what exactly is belly fat, and why should you be concerned about it? Well, belly fat is more than just a nuisance that makes your clothes feel tight. It's a type of fat that's located under your skin and around your internal organs. More than just an aesthetic issue, it's a significant health concern. There are two types of belly fat, subcutaneous fat and visceral fat. Subcutaneous fat is the kind that you can pinch with your fingers. It lies just beneath the skin and is the most visible, but it's not the most dangerous. That title goes to visceral fat. Visceral fat is deep within your abdomen, surrounding your organs. You can't see it or feel it, but it's there, and it's harmful. Why is it so bad? Because it secretes proteins that can trigger chronic inflammation, a risk factor for heart disease and other serious health conditions. Now, why does belly fat develop? There are several reasons. One major factor is poor diet. Consuming too many calories, especially from processed and sugary foods, can lead to weight gain and increased belly fat. Lack of physical activity is another big contributor. If you're not burning off the calories you consume, they get stored as fat. Age also plays a role. As we get older, our metabolism slows down and we tend to gain weight, especially around the middle. And let's not forget about genetics. If your parents or other close relatives have a large waistline, you might be more likely to develop belly fat. But don't despair. While it may seem daunting, belly fat is not invincible. It can be tackled with the right combination of diet, exercise, and lifestyle changes. And remember, it's not just about looking good, it's about improving your health and quality of life. Now that we understand the enemy, let's prepare for battle. Are you enjoying the video so far? If you are, why not subscribe to our channel to stay updated with more health tips and guides. By subscribing, you're not just joining a community, you're joining a journey, a journey towards better health and a better version of yourself. Our content is designed to help you understand your body better, make informed decisions, and ultimately improve your health and quality of life. So don't miss out on this opportunity to learn, grow, and transform. Hit that subscribe button now and join us on this journey to better health. Remember, every step, no matter how small, is a step in the right direction. The first step to losing belly fat starts in the kitchen. Indeed, it's not just about how much you eat, but more importantly, what you eat. You see, your diet plays a hefty role in shaping your body and contributing to weight loss. Imagine your body as a car. To function efficiently, it needs the right type of fuel. That's where a balanced diet comes into play. A balanced diet essentially means consuming a wide variety of foods in the right proportions. It's like providing your body with a mix of all the essential nutrients it needs to function optimally. Now let's talk about the key players in a balanced diet. Proteins, fibers, and healthy fats. Proteins are like the building blocks of your body. They not only help in muscle building and repair, but also aid in satiety, keeping you full for longer and thus curbing overeating. Fibers, on the other hand, are the unsung heroes of a balanced diet. They help to regulate your body's use of sugars, keeping your hunger and blood sugar in check. Plus, they aid in digestion and can help in achieving that flat belly you're aiming for. And let's not forget about healthy fats. Yes, you heard it right. Fats can be healthy too. Foods rich in omega-3 fatty acids, like fish, nuts, and seeds, can actually help you lose body fat. But remember, while these are important, 
cutting down on sugar and processed foods is equally crucial. These foods are often high in empty calories and low in nutrients, leading to weight gain and other health issues. Think of sugar and processed foods as the villains in our story. They might seem appealing, but they're causing more harm than good. So it's time to bid them goodbye, or at least minimize their intake. In essence, a balanced diet is not about restricting foods, but about finding the right balance. It's about making healthier choices and understanding that every food you consume is either fighting disease or feeding it. Remember, you can't out-exercise a bad diet. So let's start making smarter food choices today, shall we? Diet is half the battle. The other half is exercise. Now, let's talk about the importance of regular physical activity. Many of us have heard the saying, move it or lose it, right? Well, there's a lot of truth in that. Exercise is an essential piece of the puzzle when it comes to losing belly fat and improving overall health. So what kind of exercises should we be doing? Well, there's no one size fits all answer to that, but there are certain types of exercises that are particularly effective when it comes to tackling that stubborn belly fat. High intensity interval training, or HIIT, as it's commonly referred to, is a fantastic way to burn fat. This type of workout involves short bursts of intense exercise alternated with low intensity recovery periods. It's an efficient way to get a workout in if you're short on time, and it can be done anywhere. HIT is like a fat incinerating powerhouse that can help you burn more calories even after your workout is over. Next up is strength training. While many people associate strength training with bulking up, it's actually a great way to lose fat as well. Strength training helps build muscle. And guess what? Muscles are like little fat burning machines. The more muscle you have, the more calories you burn, even when you're at rest. And let's not forget about the good old cardio. While it may not be everyone's favorite, it's a crucial part of a well-rounded exercise routine. Cardio exercises like running, walking, or cycling are great for your heart health and can help burn calories and lose fat. But here's the thing. It's not just about what type of exercise you do, but also about how consistently you do it. You've probably heard the saying, consistency is key, and it couldn't be more true when it comes to exercise. It's better to do a moderate workout regularly than to go all out once in a blue moon. So if you're new to exercise, start slow. Choose activities you enjoy so you're more likely to stick with them. And remember, every bit of movement counts. Whether it's a walk in the park, a dance class, or a quick hit workout in your living room, as long as you're moving, you're making progress. And let's not forget the other benefits of exercise. Regular physical activity can boost your mood, reduce stress, and improve sleep. It can also help prevent various health conditions like heart disease, diabetes, and certain types of cancer. So while losing belly fat might be your primary goal, remember, exercise does so much more. It's about creating a healthier, happier you. Exercise not only helps you lose weight, but it also keeps your heart happy. It's not just about what you eat and how much you move. It's also about how you rest. Now, let's delve into the often overlooked and underappreciated factors of weight loss, sleep, and stress management. We all know sleep is essential, right? But did you know that lack of sleep can significantly impact your weight loss journey? Numerous studies suggest that people who sleep less than seven hours per night tend to have a higher body mass index. Lack of sleep disrupts your body's balance of hormones that regulate hunger and satiety. When you're sleep deprived, your body produces more ghrelin, the hormone that signals hunger, and less leptin, the hormone that tells you when you're full. This imbalance can lead to overeating. And yes, you guessed it, weight gain. But it's not just the quantity of sleep that matters, it's also the quality. Poor quality sleep or interrupted sleep can also disrupt these crucial hormones. So make sure you're getting a good night's rest. That means seven to nine hours of uninterrupted sleep for most adults. On the other hand, let's talk about stress. We've all felt it, the pressure, the tension, the worry. Chronic stress can lead to weight gain, especially around the belly. When you're stressed, your body releases a hormone called cortisol. Cortisol can lead to cravings for sugary, fatty foods. These comfort foods may help your brain feel better temporarily, but they're not so comforting for your waistline. 
Managing stress is just as important as managing your diet and exercise routine, so how can you do it? Mindful practices like meditation, yoga, or simply taking a walk in nature can help. Deep breathing exercises can also be beneficial. Remember, it's okay to ask for help. If you're feeling overwhelmed, consider seeking support from a professional. In the journey to lose belly fat, remember to take care of all aspects of your health. Take care of your mind and your body will follow. Last but not least, the secret ingredient, persistence. It's the spice that seasons our efforts, the fuel that powers our journey. You see, weight loss, just like any other worthwhile pursuit, is not a sprint, but a marathon. It's not about instant gratification, but about long-term commitment. Imagine planting a seed. You water it, you tend to it, you provide it with sunlight. But the seed doesn't sprout overnight, does it? No, it takes time, it takes patience. It's exactly the same with our bodies. They need time to adjust, to change, to grow into the best versions of themselves. We can't rush the process, nor should we. When we embark on a weight loss journey, we're not just changing our diet or our exercise routine, we're changing our lives. We're reshaping our habits, our thoughts, our attitudes. And that's not something that happens at the drop of a hat. It requires determination. It demands resilience. It calls for persistence. So, when the scale doesn't budge, or when the mirror doesn't reflect the changes you had hoped for, don't lose heart. Don't let discouragement overshadow your progress. Remember, the most beautiful transformations are often the ones that take the longest. They're the ones that demand our sweat, our tears, our grit. And yes, there will be days when you'll want to throw in the towel, when the chocolate cake will seem more appealing than the salad, when the couch will beckon more loudly than the treadmill. But don't give in. Don't let a moment of weakness derail your journey. Remember why you started. Hold on to your goals like a lighthouse in the storm. So keep going, keep pushing, keep believing, even when it's hard, especially when it's hard, because it's in the face of challenges that we grow the most. It's through persistence that we transform not just our bodies, but our lives. Persistence is what turns actions into results. So there you have it, a guide to losing belly fat in a month. Let's take a quick jog down memory lane and revisit what we've covered today. We started off by understanding belly fat, the stubborn, uninvited guest that loves to overstay its welcome. We've learned that belly fat isn't just about aesthetics. It's a health concern that can increase the risk of diseases like type 2 diabetes and heart disease. Then we moved on to the role of diet, an essential piece of the puzzle. We learned that while it's important to maintain a calorie deficit to lose weight, it's equally crucial to nourish our bodies with wholesome, nutrient-dense foods. Remember, it's not just about eating less, it's about eating right. Incorporate fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains into your meals. And let's not forget the importance of hydration. Drinking plenty of water is a golden rule we should all live by. Next, we discuss the importance of exercise. Physical activity isn't just about burning calories, it's about strengthening our bodies, boosting our metabolism, and enhancing our overall health. Cardiovascular exercises, strength training, and high-intensity interval training all have a role to play. Find what you enjoy and stick with it. Consistency is key. We then explored the power of sleep and stress management. We discovered that poor sleep and chronic stress can wreak havoc on our hormones, appetite, and metabolism, making weight loss an uphill battle. So make sure to prioritize a good night's sleep and find effective ways to manage stress. It could be yoga, meditation, or simply spending time with loved ones. Finally, we emphasize the importance of persistence. Losing belly fat is a journey, not a sprint. It requires patience, consistency, and determination. We might face setbacks, but that's okay. What matters is that we get back on track and keep going. Each small step we take is a victory in itself. Now let's not forget that everyone's body is unique. What works for one person might not work for another. So it's important to listen to your body and adjust your approach as needed. Consult with a healthcare provider if necessary. And remember, it's about being healthy, not just skinny. In the end, it's all about making sustainable lifestyle changes that we can maintain in the long run. It's not about quick fixes or drastic measures. It's about creating a healthier, happier version of ourselves, one step at a time. Remember, the journey to a healthier you 
starts with a single step. Start today, and in a month, you'll thank yourself. Did you find our guide on losing belly fat enlightening? Enjoyed the video? If you did, we have plenty more where that came from. Our channel is dedicated to providing you with reliable and practical health tips and guides. We're all on this journey towards better health and a better version of ourselves. And guess what? You don't have to do it alone. By subscribing to our channel, you're not just following a YouTube page. You're becoming part of a community that values good health and well-being. Our content is designed to help you understand your body, make informed decisions, and ultimately improve your health and quality of life. So why wait? Hit that subscribe button now and join us on this journey to better health. Remember, every step towards a healthier lifestyle is a step towards a happier you.